Hey everybody, it's been forever since I've done one of these videos. It feels weird, but great. So here we go. I made it to my first hotel. I'm at Sanctuary Capcana, which is in the Capcana area of Punta Cana, which is like the luxury uh, exclusive neighborhood. The taxi driver told me it that it's owned by somebody famous, I don't know. Anyways, I'm at Sanctuary Capcana, which is a Playa Resorts uh, res hotel. Uh, it used to be owned by another company, Playa. Bought it a couple years ago, and they've renovated it, and it's amazing. So I'm gonna start like I always do, outside the front door, and I'll take you in. Right now I'm standing at the front door at my back, so we'll turn around. Let's go out. And I'm gonna turn this around. Hola. <laughs> okay, so walked in. This is the first thing. We got this like giant closet. Uh, I got my junk in so far. A safe um, and lots of space for all my non-existent clothes. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna unpack. I'm only here for two nights. So um, got some robes. Nice, very nice quality, thick robes. Got some slippers, um, an umbrella for the rain, because you know, it is the Caribbean. Uh, iron for the clothes that I'm not gonna be ironing probably. Well, I might have to, they might be kind of wrinkly. You walk down, and then we got the baño. There I am. Oh, look at the shirt that Tori and I made. Let's see if I can, it's, uh, well, let's see if I can turn it around. There we go, you gotta see my shirt. Vaxed and waxed. We made it with my Cricut machine because we're crafty. Okay, turn it back around. Okay, we got a little area to sit and contemplate life in the bathroom. We got some hooks. We got the double sinks because, you know, usually it'd be two people staying in this room. And this is their toiletries. What do we got? We got some soap, body milk. I guess that's like body lotion, but, you know, improved. Um, we got some, you know, hand sanitizer because it's the world we're living in now. Shower cap, sewing kit, shaving kit, uh, dental kit, two dental kits, little cup. You never want to drink the water in Punta Cana. They do have a water problem. Makeup mirror. I don't know why it's on. It's turned off. And then we got uh, a big rain shower and then we got more toiletries in here uh, shampoo conditioner and bath gel and then also the shower head up here this is really nice that they also have the wand one for those people who do not like to get their hair wet when they shower all the time and then we got the oh that goes in <laughs> the toilet room I'm not a fan of the frosted glass per se, but it's just me in here, so. And they do have at this door, so that that's fine. As long as they have an exterior door, it's fine. I hate the ones that have just the frosted glass and then it's like the room. It's like no privacy. And then there's some water and then we got our mini bar. Oh, if I can open it and see which side. Oh, it's a, it's a, tr it's a trick. Okay. What we got in here? Ooh, Coors Light. Uh, I'm not sure about that. What's this one? Presidente Light. And water, Sprite, cola, and we got Pepsi and Coke, you know, just in case. No Dr. Pepper though, I mean, geez. They don't know I'm from the South. Okay, and then this is our dresser. And I got a big mirror so I can gaze at myself the next two days while I'm here by myself. Um, they got everything. So they don't come in your room unless you tell them and everything is like sealed, like my room was sealed. I had to like break the seal to get in to like let me know like they're being serious about their sanitation, which is nice. Everybody's wearing masks um, since I've been here. So they're, they're taking everything seriously, which is good. Um, yeah, a little seating area here, a little desk for all the work I'm gonna do tomorrow. Not, I'm probably gonna be on the beach, but it's just really pretty in here. I don't know, it's just well well done. I even like the curtains, they got like the ombre effect going on. And then we have my balcony. Let's see if I, okay, if I can open the doors, we'll go out to my balcony. 
Very hot and humid though. Woo, I was not ready for it. It was it takes me a minute to get used to that again. Especially breathing in the masks with the hot humidity. Oh, and my tub here. I, I, I'm excited about the tub. Sorry, I'm talking and not showing you guys the view. Showing you the tub. And then this is the view. And if you go down that way, the beach is down there. And then they have like a, a seafood restaurant down there. And and then the castle's on the other side. I'll have to take some more videos where you guys can see because the cool thing about this hotel is that the architecture is like a castle. So I toured this resort in 2017 when I came to Punta Cana and I fell in love with it. Sorry, I pushed a button. I've always wanted to stay here, so now I am. And I think that's that's it for my room tour, but I will definitely um, be showing you guys pictures and more information about this resort. I'll be here for two days. Then I transfer to La Romana, which is about an hour and some change away. I'll be staying at the Hilton. That's where the conference will be until Friday. And then I'll be coming back this direction, staying at the Hyatt Zalara, which is a new property um, for two nights. So anyways, let me flip this back around. You guys can see my well-traveled self. So anyways, that is my first uh, resort tour uh, in years. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was, uh, it's been fun so far. I'm excited about all this traveling again. I'm, I'm happy to be back on planes and back to new and exciting places and people that are not from the United States, if that makes any sense. But I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day and I'll see you later. Bye.